In this video, I show you the most important settings options of the early P3 entry signal. You can find the early P3 under scripted conditions. In the chart, you can see the early P3 indicator labelled with ERP3 and the P123 indicator in the trend size 2 labelled here as T2. The early P3 signals are marked by the dark green arrows. Now to the parameters. First of all, the trend size. The standard setting is the trend size 2. If you change the trend size, then this has an impact on the signals of the early P3, since the signals then adapt to the new trend sizes. Second, the trend age. The standard setting here is zero. This means that an early P3 signal is shown at the presumed point 3 immediately with the formation of a trend in the trend size 2. A change in the standard setting, for example to 3, now causes a signal to only be shown here when at least three corrections have taken place. The subsequent parameters should be applied with caution since they greatly change the display of the trend structure and should only be changed by advanced users. For the parameters 4, 5 and 6, the entry is made decimally. The result is a percentage change of the respective P2 and P3 trend architecture. If you need more information about the parameters for advanced users, then you will find this in the video Advanced Parameters.